Hey everybody, Ryan with CPP Tech. How you guys doing today? Thank you guys for watching. Uh, quick video on how to put in a PCIe Express uh, 1X card. Um, I We saw Mel's build. The uh, I call it Mel's Beast, but she hasn't named it yet. So we're going to we're gonna let her name this. I got a, uh, it's a, a Gigabit uh, GCWBAX uh, 200. So it's actually an AX wireless adapter card. It's got uh, Bluetooth as well with an external antenna. I'm going to show you real quick just how to put this in. All right, guys. So all you really going to need is a Phillips head screwdriver. What we're actually going to do is put it in PCI Express 1X. So we're actually going to put it into this slot here. I'm going to try to, because we have this, this uh, screw bar thing for the plexiglass for the picture i'm going to try to put it in this slot if we if we can't fit it in there we'll go down to the bottom one but hopefully we can get that to work so actually there's the wireless card that's actually built into it now if you see these two here one's for the uh wireless for the internet and then one's for the bluetooth so inside of here we have the antenna and then obviously the cables if we need it and for some reason they always, they always give you these uh, these uh, Frisbees. First thing we're going to do is I'm going to pull out this screw here, which I'm going to have to probably take this, this thing out. Now, you guys aren't going to have to do this, this part here. Uh, this is because I've modded the, the case a slight bit so we can put that piece of acrylic with the, with the picture on it. But um, we'll pull that out and then go ahead and pull this screw out. Love the magnet stuff. My fake guy fix it. And that just pulls out just like so. And then these slots here go into that slot there. So it's popped in right there. Easy and peasy. Tighten it up. So if you notice, I started off doing the top slot. When I mentioned somebody had to maybe go down at the bottom. I had to do that because in this particular board, whenever I put that card in there, it actually covered up the motherboard screw and generally that won't have a concern or be an issue however you know since i have that little picture in there for for mel you know i had to take it down one because it was actually impeding the uh the flow of that so it shouldn't really matter which one of these you plug it into because one's just it's all it is it, all it is is an antenna so just screw it on one and then screw on the other and then like i said one will do one will do your bluetooth and then the other will do uh your wi-fi so it's not not too difficult you screw that on there this thing's got a magnet there we go just like that it is done it's done it's done it's done all right, so that was quick and easy, wasn't it? So I'm not going to go over the whole setup on the desktop because it's pretty much will plug and play. Once you turn on your computer down on the right-hand side, you'll see the globe. You click that, and all the networks that are in your area will pop up. You just find yours, type in the password, and you're done. So uh, if you like this video, do yourself a favor, throw a like, a subscribe, and I thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Bye.